Yes. Read it aloud. This is on uh, May 25th, my birthday, actually. Oh, hey. Happy birthday. Yeah, thanks. How many have you had? <laughs> 44. I only had one. Yeah. <laughs> well, true. Yeah. <laughs> You're just weird. <laughs> Go ahead. Mm, he just doesn't know how to count. Now. Here it goes. This, this guy shot light into my eyes. Hold it. It was real spontaneous. This figure, this person appeared on these stairs a little bit above Hold me. Mm -hmm. It was quite dark, actually. And it's just real spontaneous. And well, I'll finish what I have here. And afterwards, I wanted to say what the Buddha had said was true. No, do it again. And afterwards, I wanted to say what the Buddha had said was true. That's the dream. No. Uh, what am I going to ask you? Uh, what was it like? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Uh, what was it like? I'll write that down. He was shooting light directly into my eyes, and it was uh, like going in. Mm -hmm. And uh, what was it like? I was just uh, uh, I couldn't move. Um, it was like nothing I've ever experienced before. Um, and direct, it was like uh, this uh, not boring. Okay, not boring. Um, <laughs> It was amazing, and uh, the, um, <coughs> spontaneous. Mm -hmm. Spon it just just happened. He appeared, and then mm So, have you uh, had experiences uh, in the past some, uh, that might be similar? Might be similar? Yeah, actually I had a dream where the, a figure came and they, they were going to do it. Oh. Like years ago. They did, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you had experiences similar to that? In terms of light, yes, but never from a person like uh, wait this. A minute. Uh, uh, Okay. Yes, I have had experiences like that, but not directly from a person. Yes. Among those past experiences were, were, that were like this, how would you grant, how would you rank, rank this one? 
really intense. Okay, yeah. shall we? Yeah. All right. Surely. Yeah. Um, what did you do when you woke up? I, I, I was in <coughs> disbelief. I was like, did that, did that, did that just happen? That's what. And then I uh, um, actually dismissed it for a while. And then I decided I, I should record it. I was, what did I do? I was just lying there, like, basically tripping out that, did, did that just happen in my dream? That's, that's what I did. Oh, and then after that, oh, I studied the Parmenides. What is that? A, a, a play <coughs> yeah. the sac uh, What was it like reading Parmenides' dialogue at that time? What was it? I imagine there were other times when you were reading the Parmenides. The day before the dream and after, yeah. yeah. And how would you rank this kind of reading? That experience? no, but um, even prior, I. Um, it's like the dream, yeah. It's I'm getting hit, right? It's been amazing. Yeah. Okay. J yeah. Oh, okay. Now tell me uh, what you said in the dream. <coughs> Go ahead. What the Buddha had said was true. Yeah. That's what I wanted to say. No. Yeah. Oh, pardon me, you didn't say it. Mm -hmm. But that was on your mind in the dream. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yes. What do you think of that? Come on. Now you can make a judgment. What do you think of that remark? It's pretty interesting. Um, it's a type of scene, right? Hmm? It's a type of scene. Yeah, that's what, true. What, yeah. From the experience. That's true. What do I think of the remark? What the Buddha had said was true. No. Is it true? Make a judgment. No. Is this? Yeah. No, okay, I just wanted to know. I don't, I'm not familiar with this stuff. Me neither, really, actually. <laughs> Come on. So you'd say, yes, this fits what? Uh, let me give you a problem, okay? Yeah. I, okay. No, yeah, okay. Um, have you ever done any sitting in a uh, Buddhist joint? Yes. Um, this is what they call what the Buddha... No. Oh! No. Not at all. Well... This would be hanky-panky, kind of like... Or, I don't know, just different, right? Other. Well, is this true then? No. In terms of... No. <laughs> See, is it what the Buddha had said? No. No. Well, actually, it is what the Buddha had said, depending upon what sutra you read. But uh, you may not know that, but that's true. Wait, what? Say there are some very early sutras of the Buddhists yeah. that do call this the highest experience. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't know that. And they even call it self. But then... A shift. Yeah, a major shift occurred. Hmm. So... In terms of early Buddhism, this is true. Uh -huh. 
And if you want the name of those early sutras, I can get them for you. Okay, yeah, please, yeah. Yeah. What, is that, what difference does that make? Well, in that case, it would be true. After hmm. it, it wouldn't, right? Hmm. It'd be false, what well, I'm thinking. What would it take, what would it do for you if you brought this awareness at the next session you went to or down there at the Zen center of this or that? What would it do to me? Let us assume you visited the one in Normandy. Yeah. Okay. All right? Mm -hmm. Now you're in Dokusan. Mm -hmm. Okay? Good. How do you think? Go ahead. With presenting this or? Yeah, just whatever that word presenting means to you. I think, hmm? it, it would, yeah, it'd be good. Oh, oh. Oh, why do you say it would be good? Because it would be clear. Oh, oh. Would you be testing them? I don't know. I don't know. Sure you do. Would I be testing? Oh, if I oh, am. Yeah. They can either dismiss it mm -hmm. or congratulate you. Mm -hmm. What follows in either case? What happens if they dismiss it? Well, according to the earlier, they're wrong. No. According to the later, they'd be. Accurate. Mm -hmm. Right? Um, how's your art been? Great. Mm -hmm. Everything's great. Uh, what's happened to you? Have you done work since this stream? Yes. What, is, what effect has it had? Yeah, all really good. It's hmm? Clearer. Maturing. Mat what? Ma maturing. Maturing. No, it raised the level of your art. Yeah, I would like to put it into another direction as well. Go ahead. I'd like to put it into another direction I've been cooking, other than what I was doing. But oh. Oh. Either, way, also... either way, it's been... Pardon? Either way is, is yeah. good. And you're also reading that dialogue. Yeah. Oh. Just, yeah. Mm. Gotten further than I've ever gotten. Mm. Helps soon. Yeah. Oh. Now you know what seeing is. Yes. On this level. Yes. Right, right. Talk to me about the person. Just suddenly appeared. He's a little taller, more t t taller in height, lean, taller in height, lean, and uh, clear. <laughs> Just clear, direct, efficient. Like a, 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 a Michael Jordan of this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh. Well, we'll have some fine fun hearing what happens when you report this at the mm -hmm. Zen Center, won't we? Yeah, when you mean report this, though, do you mean th th this actual dream? No. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Whatever state you're in, yeah. that reflects this experience, okay. you don't have to tell them anything. Yeah. 
Thanks. Or you can. It's up to you. Okay, cool. Oh. Is that something you want to do? Yeah, sure. Oh, good, good. Do you think we'd like to hear the result? Yeah, sure. Let me check. It sounds good. Yeah, that would be fun. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Mm-hmm. Well, good. Okay. All right. Deal, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> good, 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 good. Thanks. <laughs> All right. You want the dream? Now that we have nothing else to do. There's one dream I put a dream up there. there. Sir? I put a dream. My dream. Oh, bring it up. Did you want that, Brad? Yeah, sure. Get it. Are there some more? Take a picture. Take all of Oh, I didn't see it there. Okay. Right. The one that slipped okay. it in there when you were doing your work. Now, this dream also has a picture. So you might want to see the picture. It's a high level of art. <laughs> okay. You, you're my idol. You read it. Okay, here we go. I was in, in a very dimly lit room. Stop laughing at me over there. I was in a... <laughs> I was in a very dimly lit room. There was a pedestal with a book on it. All I could see is the outline of the book and a bright dot on the top middle of the book with dimly lit symbols below. Then I realized I was dreaming and started to wake up, but before, but before I remember a feeling of follow the one. Okay, read the last part again. I realized. Um, was that in the dream? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Uh, I realized I was dreaming and started to wake up, but before remembered a feeling of follow the one. No. Um, what am I going to ask? Uh, what do I make of it? No, no. Oh. What state of mind were you in when you, oh. when you saw that dot? Uh, very uh, interested, inquisitive, um, happy, content, curious. At peace. Okay. Right. That's when you were looking at it, right? Okay. What followed then? After looking at it? No. Oh. Well, I realized that uh, that what was happening was a dream, and I felt myself slipping out of it. And before I slipped out of it, I remember uh, follow the one. I had a feeling of that. What was it like when you realized you were dreaming? Um, I was like kind of upset because that meant that I was going to wake up. Hmm. That's a consequence. Mm -hmm. What was it like when you realized you were dreaming? Uh, that was actually kind of cool. Um, uh, come on, more. It was, um, I've had it before. I've had that feeling before, but this one was, uh, 
But this one, in comparison with others? It was, it was a be way better. It was more uh, aware. And uh, I've, been, I've been asking um, basically to, uh, when you told me that I was dreaming and I was in the first hypothesis, mm -hmm. I wanted to remember uh, me being there. Mm -hmm. So uh, once once I woke up that same day, I drew that that thing there. Yeah, that piece of work, yeah. that artwork. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That same day. Yeah, you say it was cool, and uh, you were more aware of this time than in past times when you were realized you were dreaming. Mm -hmm. right? Right? What's the name they give for this kind of uh, experience? Uh, an enlightenment experience? Lucid dreaming. Lucid dreaming. I wouldn't know. Yeah, <laughs> see, that's a big step in dreaming, right? Because if you can deal with the next question, you'll see it, okay? Um, same question now, look here. I realized I was dreaming. What kind of experience was this? With the eye. I realized I was, see? Mm -hmm. um, my, uh, I guess you could say my persona. Oh. Who I think I am, I guess. I don't know. Well, yeah, see, this can be the way we talk. Mm -hmm. And it may not be part of your experience. So we have to be careful in a dream. Like, the experience at that moment could be a realization of dreaming. Or it could be, I was aware of myself realizing that I was dreaming. These are different states. Mm -hmm. hmm. So what I'm, what I'm before going any further, I want to see whether this is just a grammatical thing. Right, that we've been taught to use that in the front of every sentence. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. That's fair. That you're not sure. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's good. That means it didn't play a dominant role as some separate entity realizing something. Well. Right. Yes. Yeah. Um, I felt. I felt like I was there with some. Someone else. Oh. Ah. But. There was no one there. Yeah. It was just. What was that like? Uh, it was very, very, uh, it was more, um, it was like you being there. Uh huh. And you, uh, you know, guiding me through. Uh huh. Right, guiding through. Mm -hmm. I had a, a presence of someone that was very kind and oh. loving there. Cool, right, right. See, now that raises it again. Um, see, this is, this is a higher class of dreaming, called lucid dreaming. And you can do a variety of things when you're in that state that you're now awakening. Like, if you're in that state, the next time, you could literally turn, turn around and say, Okay, who are you? Mm -hmm. Like, it, it allows more active participation in the dream mm -hmm. that would satisfy your most interesting questions, you see. That's where you're going. Awesome. Yeah. And, and it's a... Okay, what about the book? 
Talk to me about the book. Uh, the book, it was, like I said, it was like a very, very dark, it was like a candle was off on the very far distance and it was very hard to see, but I could see the outline of the book. And on the book, there was a bright dot. I'm calling it the monad. And uh, below it was, was symbols. Uh, very dimly lit. I don't know if they were numbers or symbols or, or letters or what. I was focused on that dot. Mm -hmm. And um, it, well, you it, was, it was beautiful. Notice anything interesting about the uh, candlelight? No. Okay. Um, it was just very dimly yeah. lit. No. Yeah. Uh, were you able to know whether it was on anything? Yeah, the pedestal. The, the book was on the pedestal. I could see, could see the outline of the pedestal with the, with the book okay. outline. Okay. So it was enough light to see the phenomenon? Yes. Okay. To, see, to see what the figure is. Oh, oh, oh. So, you've had experiences, obviously, right? Mm -hmm. Where would you put this one? Uh, well, shoot, I'd say it was a nine, but now it's a ten. Oh. If I said it was a nine before, and you said, no, it's a ten. Now it kind of boosted it a little bit. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> it wasn't that brilliant light. Like I, oh, oh. Yeah, it was By the way, are you in that curious work the other gentleman said? Oh, yeah. What's working? Oh. Or something? Yeah, the Permenides? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, um, what was it like going into it after the stream? <laughs> it was, uh, we were on a roll. Huh? We, we were on a roll. <laughs> yeah, it was like, we were, we, oh yeah, we're going to finish. We did some of the homework. Yeah. And I thought, ah, we're going to ace it, but we didn't finish it. <laughs> it, didn't, it didn't pan out. <laughs> <laughs> Good show. Good show. Right on, here's your... Yeah, you got it. I'm trying to understand what happened.